Okay. Well, it gives me the opportunity to kind of grow my imagination. I really like that. I like learning things about the way the world works and seeing how each little piece is connected to every other little piece to create this beautiful planet that we live on. Visual impairments should not serve as the barrier for students who are blinded or visually impaired in choosing their own path. So we came up with a very um, capable team members from the U of A and also throughout the country who have been working and specialized in this topic and put together around two keywords, project-based learning and mentorship. And this is a three-year project that is being funded by National Science Foundation. This is a great way to get students integrated with each other, whether they are blind or visually impaired or not. And um, I hope that they take away acceptance for each other no matter what. I hope they take away the fact that they can do science, because I think they may get the message that they can't when they totally, totally can. I hope they take away an appreciation for the outdoors and then carry forward into their lives. In some ways, you learn more through not using your eyes. I think because the world we live in is so visual, sighted people tend to overlook those things just because they use their eyes so much. And so since I can't use my eyes, I had to find all the other ways I could do it. And I ended up learning in some ways more. And then use the other hand to catch it. Perfect. I'm going to leave this part here right here.